Welcome to our review of Astral Ascent, a beautifully crafted roguelike game that offers a unique blend of hack and slash combat, stunning pixel art graphics, and a captivating storyline. Let's dive in. Astral Ascent boasts beautiful graphics, with pixel art in-game and hand-drawn art for cutscenes and conversations. The game offers a variety of graphics settings, including full-screen, window size, light quality, game effects, full-screen quality, and resolution scale. It also features a readability mode where characters can have an outline put on to make them more visible. The gameplay of Astral Ascent is roguelike, with each run being randomized. The game offers three save slots, full controller support, and keyboard support with rebindable controls. You can select your constellation, which affects your relations with zodiacs, and input your constellation. The game also supports local co-op play and remote play together. The combat in Astral Ascent is easy and straightforward. You can dash and jump again after hitting an enemy. Mana is used for casting spells and is built up by using basic attacks. When finding new spells, you can watch a small demonstration clip of the spell in action. The combat can get very reflex heavy and takes some getting used to, especially dodging and jumping around. Progression in Astral Ascent is marked by earning keys from fight rooms and using them to open chests for more loot. You can salvage unwanted spells and items for quartz, which is a currency used and lost in runs. The game also features an end-of-run breakdown showing unlocks, earned bankable express, and any rewards. The garden serves as your hub space where you spend time buying permanent unlocks, having conversations, and more as you progress. The stone altar allows you to choose one stone and will add a bonus to either your health, damage, or attack speed. In conclusion, Astral Ascent is a beautifully crafted game that offers a unique blend of hack and slash combat, stunning graphics, and a captivating storyline. It's very addictive and a huge time sink. However, it's worth noting that the game can be a slow starter, and the tutorial is very basic. But once you get the hang of it, you'll find yourself immersed in its world, 